This is the second video in our series on how to create and maintain GTFS Fairs V2 data using Google Sheets. In this video, we'll be covering how to get started and set up. In the first part, we'll go over how to upload and edit existing Fairs data. And in the second, I'll show you how to get a template to help you create GTFS Fairs from scratch. Links to any resources or websites mentioned in this video are listed below in the description. Before we get started, you'll need access to Google Sheets. Google Sheets is a free, web-based spreadsheet application that can be used in your web browser. If your agency has a Google Workspace account, you can easily create spreadsheets and share them with other members of your organization. Otherwise, you can still use Google Sheets by signing up for a free Google account if you don't already have one. If you already have GTFS Fairs V2 data, or you're not sure, I'll cover how to import those files into Google Sheets. If you know for sure that your agency does not have GTFS Fairs V2, you can skip ahead to the next section in this video, which covers how to get a template for creating the data from scratch. Let's take a look at your published GTFS feed and see if Ferris V2 is present. Download your GTFS feed, then unzip it. Here, I can see a bunch of files that start with FAIR. Some of these files are optional, so your feed may not look the same. However, every feed with Ferris V2 should have FAIR leg rules and FAIR products. If you see these files, congratulations. You already have Ferris V2 data. You'll need to edit and maintain it whenever your agency changes its fare or transfer prices, fare structure, or sometimes when you add or remove routes, depending on how your agency calculates fares. In Google Sheets, in the main menu, go to File and Import. Navigate to the Upload tab. Now you can drag and drop or use the File Navigator. You'll have to select files one at a time. You'll want to insert new sheet. Uncheck the box to convert text to numbers, dates, and formulas. Make sure you import all of the FAIR files. Depending on your FAIR structure, you may need to update routes.txt, so go ahead and import that as well. Here are all the possible FAIR files. FAIR products, FAIR leg rules, FAIR transfer rules, areas, stop areas, FAIR media, and timeframes. In addition, you may have some files that are experimental and not yet adopted, fare capping and rider categories. Once you've successfully imported your GTFS fares files, you're ready to move on to the next video. If you do not already have GTFS fares v2 in your feed, next I'll show you how to get a Google Sheets template with all of the files and fields already set up. Click to expand the description below this video and you'll find a link to the template. In the main menu, click Make a copy. Give it whatever name you like, and then most importantly, select a folder in your own drive or a shared drive for your agency. This is where your copy will be. Your fresh copy of the template should open in its own tab. You can close the public template, and you're ready to move on to the next video. Next up, we'll go over each of the files and fields using a simple example agency to demonstrate some of the most common use cases.